Guess what? New York Eddie's back in town because I took a road trip up to the Tennessee mountains because I got some property up there and I was hanging out for a week and he came down here and he stayed in our house down here in uh, southern Miami. So he brought some guns. Yep. We have a M&P Shield. We have a Ruger LCP 380 and we have a Sig Sawyer 938. So what is this video going to be about? It's going to be about holsters. Because I was watching some videos and everybody, I don't know, there's not a lot of good videos up there on holsters. So all three of these weapons I have personally carried throughout the mountains of Tennessee and down in Key West and where else did we go? We went to Montana, went out to Arizona. So, depending on where I was going and what I was doing, this is what I was carrying. So, let's jump into this. The best holsters that I found, and ironically enough, they're all by the same manufacturer, the Santis. And they're not expensive at all. They're rather really pretty inexpensive. All-time classic, Smith & Wesson M&P Shield. I believe this has the... It's got an extended mag on it. I don't even know how many it's got. I want to say it's got eight in it. Carried this throughout the mountains of Tennessee and throughout Kentucky. Bought the DeSantes outside the waistband holster. And the number on that one is, uh, yeah, it's really messed up. Let me get the, this bag for that. The DeSantes for the shield. The hardest is to do with one hand. This held the weapon close to the body. It did not print, even with the extended mag on it. It was not printing at all. Uh, carried it through the mountains. Typical wear was a flannel shirt most of the day with a t-shirt under it. And at evening time had a jacket on. And I never was worried about printing. Kept the weapon in nice. It's got a retention screw in there. It holds it in real nice. Excellent choice. Again, I think I paid $45 for that holster on Amazon or eBay. Check both of those places. You're going to pay a little bit more for brown on the shield. But I just went with the black. Great, great holster. And uh, Eddie's taking all these weapons back up to New York with him when he leaves. So these are all his. These are all his when he came down to stay at my house, and I went on a road trip. I just grabbed the weapon from him, and that's what I carried. So for the shield, it was the mini scabbard right hand Smith and Wesson shield, nine millimeter. That's what we got for. The shield and it is just an absolutely amazing holster. Holds the weapon in tight. Can't can't say enough good things about it. Carry this uh, probably every single day for three weeks up in the mountains of uh, Tennessee and Kentucky and through Pigeon Forge. Never once worried about retention, falling out, concealment. It's great, absolutely great. Uh, flannel shirt, t-shirt, that type of weather.